Hi Chewies, here's your Alexandra. And today I'm painting a goblin here, and this goblin is sponsored by Canvas One. He sent me a bunch of goblins and dwarfs from the Battle for Skull Pass and several other things. And yeah, this tutorial here, or painting video, is sponsored by Canvas One. Thanks, man. So, but the real purpose of this video <coughs> is not a painting tutorial, it's an answer quest, uh, and questioning and answer video uh, as a video response to Retribution Angel's 20 questions. So, here's my version. First question. How did you get into wargaming? Well, long story short, I was young and needed the money. No, not actually. <laughs> uh, well, it was the time I was around 12 years old and here in Germany uh, three nice little games were produced by MB Games. They were called StarQuest, HeroQuest and Claymore Saga. <coughs> and this games brought me into the hobby. It's a long time ago. So, how long did I play? For how long? Well, as I said, I was 12 years old when I was uh, when I started <coughs> and now I'm 31. You can count on your own on your own. So, third question. <coughs> uh what games do I play and what's my favorite? Well, I play Warhammer Fantasy and Warhammer 40k and my favorite is actually Warhammer Fantasy. This may surprise you, but it is. It actually is. <coughs> well, I also play other games. I play role-playing games like uh, <coughs> uh, Dungeons and Dragons, Shadowrun or other stuff. <coughs> and I, <coughs> sorry, I also play uh, Magic: The Gathering. If you would consider this as a war game. <laughs> so, next question: What army do I have, and what uh, is my favorite? Well, over the time, I had many, many armies, and to be honest, I couldn't actually say what's my favorite army. Well, I like Space Marines, I like my Undead, I like the Empire and Warmer 40k and Warmer Fantasy. But actually I'm 40k, I don't own one. <coughs> In Fantasy I own one. So, well, I like Chaos, I like Demons. There are so many and I can't actually decide. <clears throat> what is my least favorite army and what would I never play? Well, if you know me, you may tell it right now. It's actually orcs. I hate orcs. And Retribution Angel and I have figured out the reason why I'm not good in green stuffing. Because there's a connection between green stuff, broccoli, and orcs. <laughs> it's all green. <clears throat> so my first army. My first army was actually Necrons. This was my first playable army. <clears throat> and this was uh, back in the day where days when the Necrons itself hadn't its own uh, <coughs> army book. You could only play them with the white dwarfs. There were two white dwarfs with a army list and uh, very few metal models available. <coughs> and I actually uh, grabbed this army because yeah it was it was uh, very fast to paint. And before that I never had an actual working and functioning playable army. <coughs> so, 
So, my first model kit. Hmm. Actually, it's so long ago, I don't have a clue. I really don't have a clue. What model kit? Well, I know my first model I ever bought. This was, uh, <laughs> this may sound funny to you now, but it was actually an orc boss in uh, Mega Armor or orc knob nowadays. <clears throat> a bad moon boss in Mega Armor. Well, back in the days, the orcs were better. I don't like them nowadays. Especially the fact that uh, some of the GW uh, members have come out with a stupid idea that orcs are mushrooms. Have you ever seen a green mushroom? No. <clears throat> That's stupid as hell. So, let's go on. Why do you collect the army you collect? Well, I like the models and the background story. That's the main reason why I ever paint a model. <clears throat> I must like the model and the background story and so I will like to paint it. So, uh, da, 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 da. <clears throat> question number nine. How much money did I spend over my lifetime for wargaming? Actually, I don't know. It's too many, I know, and too much. <clears throat> and I uh, don't want to think about it. It's a hobby and it is expensive. That's all that's important. <clears throat> so, are you more a gamer or a hobbyist? Well, I'm more a painter than a gamer. I, I really, really like <clears throat> painting the miniatures. Oh, now I have the black nose. <laughs> so, question number 11. Do you paint all your miniatures? I have one rule. No unpainted miniature hits the gaming table. They don't belong there. How good of a painter am I on a scale from 1 to 10, where 10 is Golden Demon Standard? Well, first of all, there is no Golden Demon Standard. If it would be a standard... No. There is no standard in Golden Demons. <clears throat> a Golden Demon winner is so good in painting, or converting, or both, <clears throat> that he is far, far beyond any painting standards. <clears throat> but other than that, well, how much would I rate myself? I'm a very decent, good painter, but... I'm not that good to paint <coughs> and win a Golden Demon miniature. Well, my miniatures uh, are actually good enough for competitions, <coughs> for other competitions, for smaller ones. <coughs> so I would consider myself, uh, let me say, so 7.5 something along that line. <clears throat> so, do you read White Dwarf? <clears throat> well, yes, I read the White Dwarf from time to time. <clears throat> it depends on what uh, kinds of uh, <clears throat> articles uh, are right now in the White Dwarf and if it interests me or not. Most of the time nowadays the most white dwarfs don't interest me at all. Some will, some not. It depends on the white dwarf. Do you keep updated? Uh, actually, no. Not really. <clears throat> the game updates doesn't interest me so much because <clears throat> there are so much uh, uh, time periods between the games could sometimes be in half or even 
a complete year until the next game and no, I'm not so updated. <coughs> Are you playing for winning or for fun? Well, I like the background story a lot and the miniatures and I just want to have a nice game so yes, I'm playing for fun. <coughs> Uh, play, do you play tournaments? Well, I have uh, entered in two tournaments until now and I must say, no, I'm not that uh, of a tournament player. <coughs> it doesn't uh, interest me at all because uh, the people at tournaments most of the time play only for the winning and not for the fun. <clears throat> and the army lists are most of the time very strange and stupid and so that doesn't interest me because I like to play for fun <clears throat> so question number 17 how good of a gamer are you? Mm -hmm. from, scale, from, from a scale from 1 to 10 I would say uh, 3 <laughs> I know the rules So, uh, question 18. Do you cheat in your games? No. No cheating. <coughs> if you are cheating, you try to compensate for something. <laughs> <coughs> Do you get mad when you lose? Mm, no. I don't get mad when I lose, but uh, from time to time uh, <coughs> I'm getting a little bit depressed. But that's all. Not mad. Are you a lucky gamer? Lucky? Hmm. What's that? Most of the time my dices are broken. I have the ability to grab always the broken dice. So, and that was my 20 questions for Retribution Angel. <coughs> and I hope you liked this little video. And we see us in the next video. And by the way, <coughs> this miniature here uh, could be an actual entry for <coughs> my own little painting contest. This would be allowed. <laughs> Remember that. You have time until the 30th of January. So swing your brushes and paint. See you. You're Alexandra.